course, Nada will mark your map with a great wonder, but take your time with your journey. Find your pattern. Speak with others on this station. They have things to offer you also. Return to us when you please, Traveler Entity. You are always welcome here. Whoa, okay. Complete Nexus missions. Continue the search for Artemis. Return to space, search for clues about Artemis among the stars. Okay, interesting. Is there a place to melt my ship? The Nexus. Complete missions with other travelers to assist Nada and Polo. These are the rewards, I would imagine. Okay. I... My brain is floating. Hello, hold on. Hello, everybody. Welcome on back. How's it going? I hope you guys are having a great day. I should say hello, Brewberries. Oh my gosh, my brain's exploding. This place is so cool. There is so much here that you can do. And it's absolutely epic. Hey, that guy's got my ship, but it's just got like a little wing on the back. I really want to melt this ship, so I still think I'm going to go and this is the that's our ship over there is the uh, extra guy that we found. So I think I'm going to I'm going to search around to see if there's a place to actually sell instead. But if not, I'm just going to melt uh, it down because we have so many ships and I just don't think I need them. What are you? Quicksilver Synthesis Companion. Create exotic items, collect expedition rewards. Okay, I uh, don't have any Quicksilver, so we will we'll do that later, but oh, I don't have any idea what the plan is for right now. I kind of am just exploring around and discovering Iteration Aries. That is a creeptastic thing. Hopes to make progress. Test themselves. I will help in exchange. Salvage technology. Transmit milestone data. You have seen much, but do you understand? Not for me to know. Please take this. Whoa, we got a lot of... Okay, so exploring, you get nanites. This guy gave us nanites. What's in here? Anything? Nothing. We can't go in there. This guy gave us nanites for our discovery data, I think. That guy gives us nanites for finding, uh, like, our actual, like, discoveries and stuff. Oh, that guy gave us data for the planets we've found. Kronos. Sniffs at me with a derisory look, trying to detect the items I carry from the scent. Nothing? Pa. You know what? I don't have any idea what you need, bro. Interesting. That guy has a interesting alien head. Egg sequencer. Whoa. Oh, I bet. Insert viable egg and catalyst. Oh, I wonder. The whispering egg must be. That's an appearance modifier. I bet that's where you put the whispering eggs that you can get. Because one of you had mentioned that you can indeed get them. You just have to be a bit sneaky. But look back here. Back here, there is all these different upgrade things. And there's so much stuff. It's absolutely insane. Like, oh, it's insane. I would go into it, but my brain, my brain is overloading right now. There's like, I looked at the building. What are you? Iteration Mercury. You have a creepy face. Have you stood before a portal, stranger? Felt it leech the life from your skin, felt your chest burning. I have, actually. Narrows her eyes staring at me, judging my claim. After a moment, they nod. There is respect upon their face. I stood before the portal as soul of prime, but did not cross the threshold. I, I reached out, only the tip of my finger grazed the gateway. The next moment I awoke aboard the anomaly. I was transformed. The gateway here does not have the power of the ancient monoliths, though it shares aspects of their network. Use it as you wish. I will nod with respect. Returns my nod. There is much understanding in this simple gesture. Okay, so this we can take back and forth from our portal to the anomaly. Okay, that makes more sense about what in the world the anomaly is there for. 
Well, cool. What are you iteration? This? A little stale. Okay. Oh, hello, new friend. We've not met. You know that that it's it's tradition to introduce yourself with an exchange of units. All right. I'll give it to you, even though I know you don't need it. Thanks. Well met. Bye now. Stay. You are still here. Sorry, friend. I don't have anything to trade. Smell them. Looks uncomfortable. Their pulse viable in their throat. All right, fine. Look, I admit it. I'm not a geck. I'm just another traveler passing through. Ask why they're here. Hesitates. Have you ever crossed paths with the sentinels who patrol most of the worlds out there? I have. Then you know what it's like to be hunted by them. Suffice to say, the Sentinels and I had a conflict of interest, and now it's in my interest to lay low here. Got it. So, you still took my units, but, uh, whatever. I don't care. And units is nothing. Yeah, this is really, really epic, man. Really epic. I'm kind of curious. I'm going to keep searching around, and then I'll, I'll be back. What is this weirdo? Is there anyone out there? It's outside. Something's wrong. Identify yourself. I tell the stranger that I can hear them. There is a moment's pause. The only sound I hear is the background hiss of cosmic radiation. You you found me. There's so little light. I thought I'd never hear another soul again. I really did. How did you find my voice? Say so you found a crashed ship. About the abandoned starship wreck and how I found the communicator ID and the distress beacon. I begin to mention the anomalous space station, but they cut me off. It's outside, but I think I'm safe. There are 16 of them. They ju they look just like... Ask where they are. Fear and confusion dance within the eyes of the stranger. After a few moments of silence, they turn to me, imploring. You don't know who you are, do you? You... It lied to me. It lied to all of. The sound cuts, cuts out, but their face lingers on, silent before it too fades into nothingness in communication. This must be Artemis and they are clearly in need of help. I need to find a way to boost their signal. Your base is in another system. Teleport back instantly using the space station teleporter or construct a new base using the base computer. I will do that. But first, let's go melt this ship. It's worth three, we can melt it for 3.9. Have we already gotten this? Yes, we did. 3.9. This guy is how much? Oh, sick. We can get it. Sweet. Say goodbye, Totori's rebuilt initiator. I already have you, and I don't want you. Let's claim the scrap. Starship and all cargo will be destroyed. All cargo will be destroyed. Let's see, do we have anything in here? All right, let's claim it. Five inventory slots are required. Oh, does it? One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, I bet it keeps everything. Okay. Okay. Hmm. Do put this guy here, and now we should have five slots for all our stuff. And now we can go melt it. What are you talking about? Inventory's not full. I'm so confused. Is it technology spaces that I need? Sheesh, there we go. Salvage components will be added. Oh my goodness. Whoa. It was saying I needed five things. Did that? Yeah, okay, it just brought out that guy. Rhymony. So handful of cogs so does this mean if i sell this superconducting fiber oh so i have to sell this stuff to get the the actual moolah i guess wait no don't go in press indium scraps this is the three million i actually got a decent to do that then we have three million. We need three million four hundred. Let's. I guess we can sell the superconducting fiber. Maybe it's not that great. Let's lower it down. 
and just get, I think this will be enough. We'll do that. We have 3.474 million or something like that now, and I should be able to buy the other, the, the gun thing. It's another journey milestone. Magnate. Whoa, earned 3 million units. Ah, okay, so that's because I went and did that thing. Okay, let's get this guy. Weapon terminal. Ozone elevator. Let us compare. Three, four, five, and we do have that. It is significantly better. And yes, 16, and it's alien. Let's waveform focuser, new multi tool. Let's get it. Nice. So this is our multi-tool now. Sick. So can we change multi-tools? Vehicles, utilities. Change secondary weapon. Oh no. Okay, uh, let's go back. Swap multi-tool to this guy. And then can we, on the multi-tool, since we did this, do we actually, man, you can't uninstall this, whatever. But we got a new multi-tool, very cool. Okay, let's go back, uh, go back to a different type of ship I've never seen. Hello, Radiant Pillar. What do you have in your, oh, you're kind of just, Junk. I did find a chest. I found a chest, guys. I used all the salvage data to get a chest that we can put down in, in our base. Isn't that exciting? Oh, I already got this. Uh. Okay, let's use this to get home. Your bases, other bases. Oh, so we can just travel to other people's places now? That is so cool. Okay, let's go to Brutopia. Warp. Vehicles. Uh, no, I don't want that. I want guide. Uh, getting around vehicles. Unlock Exocraft by purchasing plans for Geobase at the Construction Research Unit. To summon an Exocraft, build an Exocraft Geobay. Geobase can be built anywhere and they are not restricted to your home planet. When driving an Exocraft, press L for a short boost. When driving an Exocraft, you see to ping for nearby points of interest. There is more powerful multi-tool scanner and will reveal. Okay, fire your weapon. Cool. Purchase and upgrade Exocraft. Um, very interesting. Oh, Radiant Pillar, what are you doing inside of my house? Okay, so the first primary thing I want to do. Buildable technology. Uh, let's go to the... Where is it? Oh, well, here it is. Here it is. Storage container. So we need magnetized ferrite and sodium to make a storage container. Okay, we should be able to build this now. Oh, this is significantly larger than I thought it was going to be. Uh, uh, okay, I can, I'm can. i realizing now an interior base is probably not something that we're going to be doing for long. Let's just plop this guy right there, I guess. And yeah, you need power, you need power. I understand, I understand. Do that. Do that. Nice and powered storage container. 20 slots, moderate upgrade for a Starship Photon Cannon Shield. So we, oops. 
Okay. This is interesting. Okay, let's put these guys in here because we don't we can do these like every other episode. Uh storage container. Aim, we will just keep it. Wait, can we access our ship directly? Oh, that's cool. So you can take it and you can put it right in. Okay, we're gonna take gold nugget, the Viking, the gold, Gek, Eline. Don't really know what that is. We're gonna put that away. This is really cool. Salvage data, we can get more upgrades when we're at the space station. We're gonna put this away. I still, I haven't seen your comments yet, so I'm gonna maybe wait to do the rest of this episode until I see what this autobiography thing is. So that will come shortly, I think. Let's see. Space Computer Archives says it has something for me. It's recovered 6% new data available. Search the archives. Found additional buried technology modules, construction proceeding smoothly, recent expedition, yield, copying data too. Construction logs recovered, blueprints reassembled, and prepared for download. Search for construction database. Exosuit technology data extracted, downloading plans, personal grade module synthesis, synth synthesized from data scraps. Readable archive retrieval complete, beginning the fragmentation of next segment. Nice. Underwater protection module. Cool. Archive recovery is in progress. Oh, so it, it, your computer will just continue to do stuff. Okay, let's install this technology. Does it not have a terrain manipulator? Huh, it does not. We need that. Oh, carbon nanotubes we can do. Easy. And the advanced mining laser. We need two looms. Three looms. Got it. Give me a moment. We are going to be exploring around for just a bit, trying to figure out what in the world to do. Let's get rid of this rusted metal. All right, so we are back here at the anomaly, and uh, I'm wanting to show you a couple things that I, I would like to work towards. Hello there, iteration whatever. I don't know what your name is. Let's go into, no, not the wave. I just need to change my hotkey so I actually go into this properly so we're gonna explore around here and then which way is it i think it's this way yeah 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 yeah, yeah. so <clears throat> i would like to take a look see at what is this construction research station so this is the geo bay this is something that we desperately should get because then we can get these cool roamer things and i think it would be really cool roamer geo bay and then it's got the Exocraft Summoning Station, Nomad Geobay, and there's all sorts of interesting things. You can make race obstacles. Very, very interesting. And then also, this is the Exosuit upgrades. I want to go for this personal refiner because then we don't have to carry around our portable one anymore. We already have one. It does require fuel and is limited to refining one substance at a time, but that sounds very, very helpful. So I would like to do that and then we can get that going. Um, and then you've got all sorts of resistances and stuff at a duration user is able to swim underwater. Oh, okay. Um, so that is something we want. Um, and then this is the ship, right? There we go. I accidentally sent that person something, but didn't mean to. Um, then what I would like to do, we already have this instability, a highly advanced upgrade for the pulse engine, vastly increasing fuel efficiency. That would be nice. Tritium hypercluster. Okay, that's not even that bad. Um, what I'd like to do is let's go to the over here. I believe the multi tool is. Are you the multi tool? Yeah, multi-tool upgrade. So I would like, we got the pulse splitter and I would like to do the scatter blaster because I have an upgrade for it. Let me make sure. We've got pulse splitter and then we've got the Corvax made shells for the a class A scatter blaster upgrade, which seems pretty darn good. And we have the advanced mining laser, which would be really nice. We just need some wiring looms. 
So I'm thinking for this guy, what we do is we get the scatter blaster upgrade so that we can have a better weapon. We just need wiring looms. That seems to be kind of like the thing. Blaze javelin, instantaneous damage on targets, charge creates an ionized gas arc. Interesting. So then we have the advanced mining laser and then we'll have the optical yeah. drill. Wait, hold on. Whoa, 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 whoa. This already has the optical drill. Highly calibrated focusing mining beam on atomic levels is extra precise, allows for highly efficient mining, eliminates or are extracted more efficiently, increasing the yield. And then this with high grade living glass, allowing the beam to be effective against large and or rare. So my question is, can mining speed 15% resources mine? If I have both of them, then I feel like it's fine. Yeah, I think it's fine. Okay, let's see what else we can do on this this guy here. So we'll have that. A powerful lateral processor inserted into the multi-tool scanning system allows the device to recharge at significantly improved rate, increases potential scan frequency. Oh, okay, so that's nice. And then it also increases the radius. We've got the com the the shield, and then we have a recoil stabilized weapon scope for precise combat. Ooh, that seems kind of interesting. Shell greaser, scatter blaster offering significant improvements. Um, and then pulse splitter, barrel ionizer, improves device accuracy and allows the user to fire for longer periods without degrading combat performance. Uh-huh, okay. So this is for the bolt caster. But for, I may use the, the this guy more often than not. I don't know. Uh, combat scope. A recoil stabilizing weapon scope for precise combat. Yes, yes, yes. Ah, let's go for it. Might as well see what that's all about because I think that could be quite fun. Um, what are you? Synthesis laboratory. Interesting. Specialist optical employing an... Employing an impossibly polished surface to mirror is able to selectively filter different wavelengths of light, changing its reflective. Okay, so this is purely just for... Wait, hold on. Can I make a wiring loom? Is that here? Whoa, you can use warp cells to make these? Atlas Pass. Security and permissions pass granted to specific travelers by many primary galactic species. Provides access to low level. <gasps> Let's do that. Okay, I definitely want to make that. That's not even that hard. Microprocessor? Psh. Atlas Pass 2 could be good. I don't know how to make cadmium, though. Man, I am just, I'm ready. I'm ready. A microprocessor, we definitely want to be able to make that. So this is like just general recipes maker. Uh, and then this would be good. Hmm. I'm curious where the, why? Oh, hold on. Oh. Oh. So valuable products. Oh, I understand. So we can make acid. And then we can make these things portable reactor. And then we can do those things. Is the wiring loom in here? No, it's not. OK, whatever. Hey, I feel like this is a definite good thing to uh, invest into hello person that i accidentally sent something to what do you have iteration parsies or par, 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 exocraft upgrades ah okay so this will allow us to do upgrades to it i don't need that right now so let's go ahead are you interactable no okay let's go ahead and look at this maybe we can research oh this is the building stuff okay so here we go this is what i need small prefabs no save beacon yes this is where we want to go so medium refiner requires 10 salvage data yeah we don't have that so we're gonna need this is what i'd like to work towards a bit we need some salvage data for this stuff because it's like this is like where I think it's important. Like we need 10 for a landing pad would be awesome. A galactic trade terminal at our house would be awesome. So that is what I would like to tackle today. I'm going to do a, also a warp today. 
Uh, I think we're going to do that right now. Uh, now that I've kind of figured things out a little bit. Um, because I would like... One of you had mentioned that after a few times of doing a warp, uh, after like your third one or something, you will actually jump to a place where a freighter's under attack. And I thought that could be really fun. Holy balls, you're coming in hot. So let's see here. This, we've got plenty of storage. We do have four salvage data. We could go and upgrade something. Antimatter, wiring loom. Yeah, so this still needs installed fully, but that's okay. Multi-tool, and also one of you did say if we hermetic seal wiring loom, we could buy a wiring loom. I don't know. So this should go next to that. Ah, okay. So this this makes a lot of sense. It makes makes a lot of sense now because I had no concept that this was a thing to where you put them next to each other and it actually helped out. So if we go to our exosuit and go to the technology section we have our jetpack here and not really needy like not doing anything so let's go let's put the hazard protection maybe down here put this guy here okay this is gonna be a bit of a, a pain and took us huh so we'll do that and then we can upgrade our our backpack i'm guessing eventually to be able to oh we have so much navigation data so now we actually are getting the boost and before we weren't and I was just slightly insane. Um, let's move the oxygen recycler over here. Oh. Well, that makes sense. Oh, that's considered uh, it's an upgrade. Oh, it's all coming together now. Okay, dokey. What a good day. So these things, should I keep them? These uh superconducting fibers and all that stuff photon cannon uh for the starship shield module so we could do that can we un oh wait hold on we've got our thrusters here let's move some of this stuff around oh we just need chromatic metal and then we could plop these here i cannot move this we can dismantle as well. So maybe let's see. I might just buy some uh, chromatic metal. Here, give me a moment. Well, that's helpful. It says, it, the fact that it says that it is only useful as scrap to be sold. I do like that. Scrap to be sold. Cool. Does that say that about this? Final creation for many scientific components. Okay, so this could be something worth hanging on to. If not, I doesn't matter. But it says that there's actual use to it, so we will hold on to it at least for a little bit. And okay, I thought maybe they would have something here. We have activated copper, which I think we actually need some activated copper for something, but I can't remember why, so I'm not going to care that much about it um do they have the did or do to did a who to her to head he to uh nope doesn't look like it that's good all right let's let's warp and see what happens and after just a bit of trading look at all the free space we have now so i only need two wiring looms and antimatter and then we should be good. And actually, I should buy the wiring looms here um, because they're all selling them pretty much. And the reason why I want to buy it is because it's at a reduced price, 20, minus 22%. So let's get on out of this area here. And let's, I guess, warp and try out the warp warping again. Let's navigational data received. Black hole. Do we want to go there? Uh destination black hole. 
I guess let's go to the one that's right there. I don't know why it said there's a black hole, but we'll go closer to it, see what happens. Euclid Galaxy, first contact. Okay, there's the space station. And... Holy... What the frick is happening? What are you? What is this? Guess, would you, would that be considered a freighter? I don't know, let's go over here. Got high sentinel activity, of course. You know, of all things, I was not expecting to have to climb a ladder in this game. I would have figured it would have just teleported me up. What is this? Holographic comms tower. Recharge. Okay, take my sodium. Multiple signals available. Power hosts a powerful transmitter designed to facilitate holographic communication across long distances. The extra power should allow me to re-establish re the connection Artemis. Tune to his frequency. It's a hers. Locate their frequency, uploading the data from our previous communication. Whoa. Hello, Artemis. Who's there? You, you, it's you again. You really are real, aren't you? You're in a dream. Uh, I am real. It's hard to think here. Something's wrong with the... It's easier to create a better reality when you have to. I thought you might be a dream. I'm sorry, I haven't heard another voice in so long. Not since I cut the speaker from my exosuit. It said su such terrible things. Who are they? The stranger smiles through the static. I'm just like you, a traveler of worlds, aren't you? What do you mean? They transmit a vision, a red star, and a fragile world. I do not understand the shapes within the whispers. I see life forms scattered to the far reaches of the galaxies. I see this stranger's first breath yearning for the stars. I see myself slumbering in the crimson void waiting for a dream of worlds. And through the darkness I hear it said, Anomaly detected. Awaken? What I showed you just now, it has haunted me since I awoke. You must recognize it too. We are the travelers, discoverers of worlds. From the moment you opened your eyes, you must have known you were not like the others. So did I. Before I became stranded here, I was on a journey to... to finally meet. It cannot be a coincidence that you found the signal. Tell me, do you still have the data log from that crashed ship? Uh... Mention nada. Who? Please, I have to see that data. Don't toy with me, I don't have time. Okay, upload the data. Records including the stranger transmission I received and the data I found at the crashed vessel. Much of my equipment is damaged. I am alone, on foot, stranded on a sunless world. I don't even know how your signal is reaching me, but this ship you found, it belonged to me once. Perhaps there is hope after all. We need to work out where we both are. If you build signal boosters across this system, you should be able to triangulate your position. I'll be able to blah, 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 find my way out and you'll get all the answers you seek. Sure. Thank you, Traveler. You're going to save my life. You're going to find me. Triangulate your position. Place the first beacon. Outpost signal detection. Exosuit upgrade unit detection online. Triangulate my position. Ready for next position. Triangulate. And I'm guessing triangulate means three locations. Oh, okay. We're supposed to return to space to contact Artemis. Got it. Holy. What is happening? I 
When I first reached out to the heavens, I had no idea what to expect. The beauty, the mystery, the, the adventure, the danger, and here we are, aren't we? Go to the hollow terminus, upload your data, let's find each other. Uh, freighter. These are like, are these all just freighters? Is, do you enter there? Can you enter? Yeah, oh, I can. Oh, it's much bigger than I thought. Whoa. What is this? What is up here? This is cool. Jeez, that door didn't open for a moment. What? Who is Admiral Konik? Admiral Konik. don't understand you. An air of weary authority clearly marks this being as the freighter's captain. Do they tire of the burden of ownership, I wonder? The responsibility for the life and livelihood of their crew must weigh heavily on their mind. They seem amenable to offer. A freighter brings access to a large inventory, a hangar bay in which to store multiple ships, and space in which to construct an orbital base. I will offer to buy this. Six freaking million? I don't have that. Ugh. Okay. I don't have that type of moolah, my dude. But I I can get it. I can get it. Okay, so cool. This is the freighter. Um I guess I you know what? Well, I'm gonna explore this for a moment. This is huge. Like really big. Microprocessor. That's nice. And then these are Atlas passes. Okay. Um I I think I'm gonna leave it here because I'd like your input on this before I progress further. So do I have to choose this freighter? Or if I don't come back and do this i'm i keep seeing freighters appearing so i'm assuming they'll just keep on appearing um what yeah what should i what should i do freighter crew what should i do should i should i try and like find ships and sell them and all that jazz and make money to be able to buy this or should i hold off and wait you let me no, but that's going to have to be where we leave it off for today's episode, y'all, because, uh, yeah, we just, we've done a lot. We've explored a lot and now we have access to this freighter to maybe come back to and buy or not. I don't know. I have no concept. So yeah, I hope you guys have enjoyed it. We're finding Artemis and that'll be happening soon. We really wasn't thinking about progressing in that realm today but we did um hope you guys have enjoyed and if you did leave a like in real life and i'll see you guys in the next episode of no man's sky uh, bye bye